June began settled and quite sunny in most areas, with high pressure established over the UK for the first 10 days. Although it soon became more unsettled and cooler, the end of the month was once again mainly fine and settled. The provisional UK mean temperature was 12.8 degrees Celsius, which is 0.2 degrees Celsius below the 1981 to 2010 average, but still warmer than June in the last two years. The UK overall received 63% of average rainfall and 178 hours of sunshine, which is 5% above the long-term average. Let's take a closer look at the weather throughout the month and some of your photos you sent in via Twitter. It was a settled start to the month with high pressure building from the southwest to give dry and sunny days. Temperatures rose to a maximum of 24.7 degrees Celsius at Porth Maddock on the 7th. A change to more unsettled conditions saw localised flash flooding reported in West Cornwall on the night of the 7th and the 8th, when storms produced nearly 40 millimetres of rain in three hours. It was windy in the south with a gust of 60 miles an hour recorded at Needles Old Battery on the 13th. A band of rain spread quickly from the west on the 14th with Bally Kelly recording a total of 39.8 millimetres. It became warmer towards the end of the month with 24.8 degrees Celsius recorded at Usk in Monmouthshire and 26.4 degrees Celsius at Hurstmonceau on the 19th. The humid weather caused some thunderstorms in southern and eastern areas of England on the 20th and the 21st. Despite the warm weather, it was wet and windy for Scotland on the 22nd and the 23rd. But the warm weather continued for the rest of the month, with a top temperature of 27.2 degrees Celsius recorded at Heathrow on the 30th. So where were the warmest, coldest, wettest and windiest places during June? The top temperature of the month was 27.2 degrees Celsius, recorded at Heathrow on the 30th. In contrast, the minimum temperature of minus 1.1 degrees Celsius was recorded at Tullock Bridge on the 1st. Ballypatrick Forest saw the most rainfall during the month, with 39.8 millimetres on the 14th, while Capel Currig saw the strongest wind with a gust of 67 miles an hour on the 23rd. Here are some of your June weather pictures you sent in through Twitter. Send us your photos of July weather and you could feature in next month's summary video.